Hello guys, Soft Tony here and welcome back to this brand new After Effects tutorial. In this one we're going to create professional light leaks animation without using any third party plugins. Also if you haven't subscribed to my channel, please consider to subscribe, also hit the like button and turn on the notification bell so you never miss any of my upcoming video tutorials. So without any wait, let's jump into After Effects and start creating. Alright, we're here in After Effects and as you can see I have already imported here my Media 01. Of course you will import your own footage. This is full HD 1920 by 1080 It doesn't matter, you can also import 4K or whatever fits to you. Now let's create the solid layer, go right click to create new solid layer. This is gonna be light leaks, okay, 1920 by 1080 and then hit OK. Now go here in the Facts and Preset and if you can't find the Facts and Preset just go Window and you will find a Facts and Preset here. Now let's type Fractal Noise Effect, drag and drop onto the Light Leaks Effect and here let's make a few adjustments for this Fractal Type. Instead of Basic let's change to Dynamic Progressive, for the Noise Type let's change here to Block, OK. For the Contrast Type 200, for the Brightness minus 80, OK. For the complexity lower down to 1, ok, open up this transform option, here you can play around with the scale option, I will do somewhere around 275, ok, also you can play around with the offset turbulence, maybe 505. Now let's animate evolution option, hold alt on your keyboard and then left mouse click and type here wiggle, open and close bracket and let's type here 0 0.5 comma 500, ok. Hit 0 on your keyboard here in the finals. I'll just turn off the sound of this media 01, hit 0 and this is looking really really awesome for now. Ok, now let's import our next effect, this is gonna be Colorama effect, drag and drop onto the light leak solid layer. Ok, find here option output cycle and for the preset let's find fire. And now as you can see we have this orange and yellow fire light leaks in After Effects. Ok, let's add our next effect, this is gonna be hue and saturation, drag and drop onto the light leaks effect, check this option colorize, also for the saturation instead of 25 let's play around maybe to around 80 and let's also animate this uh, colorize hue, hold alt on your keyboard and then also left mouse click and let's type here wiggle again, open and close bracket 5 comma 50 okay copy this hit ctrl plus a and then hit ctrl plus c we're going this because we will also copy this on opacity property hit ctrl plus c okay and hit zero on your keyboard and as you can see our colors are changing this is looking cool hit also t on this light leak solid layer okay hold alt on your keyboard again and let's type here for the opacity again wiggle 5 comma 50 hit 0 on your keyboard and now we have something like this. Our next step is to pre-compose this light click solid layer, hit here then go right click to pre-compose, I'll just rename this one to light leaks, make sure that you choose this second option, move all attributes into the new composition and then hit ok. Now let's play around with the blending modes, if you can't find blending modes just hit here toggle switches and modes, ok. And let's try maybe for this first option, add blending mode and as you can see this is looking cool. Hit T also for opacity and let's lower it down to maybe 30%. Hit 0 on your keyboard and as you can see we have cool block light leaks here in our final scene. You can also change from light to lighten or color dodge, screen, whatever fits on you. Just play around until you're satisfied with your own result. Hit also T for opacity again, you can play around here maybe, bring this up to around 50% and then this is looking cool. You can also make these blocks even smaller, just go here on the light leaks and then go here again on fractal noise, open up this transform option, instead of 275 you can play around maybe to around 60 or something like this and light leaks will be something like this here in the final scene. Ok, I'll just do control plus Z, ok. And in our finals we have this cool looking light leaks. You can also change here the shape, go here in the fractal noise again. And instead of this noise type lock, maybe to change to spline. Okay, 
and for the scale here in transform option instead of 275 let's go around 1000 okay and now as you can see we have different type of this light leaks here in the scene also hit t to play around with the opacity hit zero on your keyboard and now this is looking cool here in the scene all right guys i have shown you this cool technique to create your light leaks option you can combine this option with uh, block option also if you want to do this just hit ctrl plus d on this uh, light leaks again import here in the scene okay change blending modes to maybe add and then for this light leaks o2 hit f3 change back this to block okay and for the transform option let's go 275 again and here in the finals we will also have this block light leaks and this second one spline and this is looking really cool and really awesome basically it's up to you to play around with all of those options okay guys uh, that was everything for today's tutorial if you haven't subscribed to my channel please hit that subscribe button if you found this video helpful please hit that like button also all the links are in description you can leave me a comment down below in the comment section also take a look on my channel on my profile for more great tutorials and until next time stay creative and bye bye